Hey, welcome back to another GTA 5 Online video, the series where me and my friends mess around and get minimal to nothing done. However, if you do go on to enjoy this video, drop a like and a sub as this really helps out the channel, and I'll stop waffling, so let's get into it. We start off today's session with a cheeky meet up on quad bikes. At least, that's what I thought I'd see, but no, Crew Dag and Josh greet me with a cement mixer. We stop off for ammo, and Crew Dag proceeds to judo kick me off my quad. I can't let him disrespect me, so I'm forced to take him out. I go AFK for 5 minutes, and Josh really crashes into me. And I can't lie there, I went down faster than a YouTube boxer taking a paycheck. IRL, I think I went for dinner, or something more realistic like going to chat to Josh's mum. But on a serious note, can someone please explain to me how I got a 2 star wanted level while being AFK, like this game is honestly just rigged and Rockstar hates me. I then take Josh to collect his car from the impound and see to it he gets on his custom quad bike safely. I then meet up at the casino with the boys, or should I say, Bossom Pals. I'm aware I'm not saying that correctly, but not everyone can speak fluent English. Take Big Smoke for example. I don't even think anyone is going to know who Big Smoke is. Pretty sure he's made a total appearance of 5 seconds on this channel. Sorry about that mate, but when your GTA character is a walking strike on YouTube, then funny enough, you're not making the vid. And here are some reactments of the Paul vs Tommy Fury fight. Big wins Tommy. And here jumping for Los Santos is Josh, and that is extraordinary, he's definitely got the gold medal there. And moving away from the Tom Daly regen, we head to our prep mission. We thank the boat driver for his troubles and we head to the prep mission. With a smooth landing we land on the beach quite comfortably. We take out the enemy and are then visited by an incompetent Nitro Zelo in a fighter jet. However, maybe the boat parking wasn't as great as we thought because now the plane is blocked. I then want to tell you how many times Nitro Zelo nearly took us out with his fighter jet. There's one here where he nearly rams into the back end of us with his wing. There's another one here where he nearly takes the top out half of the plane out of his wing. And then Crudag challenges me that I can't do three loop to loops. Well, guess what, mate? I absolutely smashed all three. Here are the clips. However, a very mentally ill and suicidal Josh decides to hop out of my plane with a parachute. At least he was safe. Then, due to Josh's antics, we are forced to wait at the airport for the rest of the boys. Nitro Zelo doing what Nitro Zelo does turns up in absolute style and then goes back to being himself again as he nearly kills us with the car. We then head off to Keo Perico, not Kaio Perico, you absolute be- We then land in Keo Perico and quick disclaimer, make sure to watch out for these titanium bushes as they were claiming lives recently. Crudag is then caught, followed by Mr. Joshua. Well, I guess my team relies on me, relied on me as I get caught and I'm sent back to spawn. Then in great fashion, I get carried and they do the prep without me. We then finish the last prep. By we, I mean them, as I sit back and do nothing while they do the mission without me. We head inside Crudag's sub, and all I must say is Nitro Zelo, you've never looked so dashing. And ladies, sadly, he is taken. By who you ask? Well, the boss and pals, of course. Let's take a moment to realise how realistic GTA 5 Online actually is. If you've seriously never flown to the moon in a flying car with a dog and an Andrew Tate Bob the Builder lookalike, then go outside and touch some grass. Feels a bit weird that the content creator who sat in his room editing this right now has told you to touch grass, but sucks to suck I guess. We then head to Los Santos Customs because Crudag needs to customise his car, to show how many peas he makes, but we all know that he's compensating for something. He reveals his car and I can't lie, I just sat in a car park in Los Santos Customs for 15 minutes only for him to produce that absolute piece of Well, the game's a game. We then head back to Crudag's sub, as we're planning on doing K Perico in the next video, because I need content. I would like to just take a moment to ask all my viewers if there's any other games that everyone would like me playing because yes GTA 5 Online is quite a fun game to play with all my mates but eventually I am going to burn out of this game so if there's any games that you'd like me to try then please recommend them to me. I was thinking similar games to GTA 5 like Watch Dogs 2 and Red Dead Redemption but if you've got any others just let me know in the comments. We then pull up Skirt like World War 2 and we arrive at the bay. We've only got one more prep to do before we can finally do Kea Perico. These two comedians think it's funny to do the classic dad trick and leave me. However, Nitro Zelo gets a piece of his own medicine as I yank him off the boat. Get good, kid. Snooze you lose. I then wave him goodbye before I sadly have to let him on the boat. 
We arrive on land, but I'm no sheep, so I take my own car to the prep mission. The city is so crowded, sometimes it's really hard to find a good parking spot. There's one. We arrive into the apartment and I notice there are a lot of bodies on the ground. Don't worry YouTube, they're just sleeping and that isn't blood underneath them, that's jam. I really don't want to get demonetized. As you can see there, that is clearly a nerf gun. We then steal, I, I mean, borrow with no intention of giving it back, the supplies. And then we take off running. When I say take off running, I mean take off crashing as Crudag is not the best driver. And then we complete the preps. Just like to take a moment that my YouTube shorts is kind of popping off at the minute and if you would give that some support, it'd be really much appreciated. However, that's all we got time for today and thanks for watching. I guess I'll see you guys in the next video.